We're talking about knowledge of the future in movies, YouTube channel, Easter Egg Psychic. In this video, I'll take a look at actor Sean William Scott. He's known for his part as Stifler in the American Pie film series. Four movies released between 99 and 2012. The cast also included actors Jason Biggs, Shannon Elizabeth, Thomas Ian Nicholas, Eddie K. Thomas, Chris Klein, Allison Hannigan. He was in The Rundown in 2003, an action comedy with Dwayne Johnson, Wrestler The Rock, Christopher Walken, Rosario Dawson. Arnold Schwarzenegger has a cameo in this also. He was in the frat comedy movie Old School in 2003 with Luke Wilson, Will Ferrell, Vince Vaughn, Jeremy Piven, and Juliet Lewis. So I took a look at Sean William Scott. I believe he may resemble actor Dennis Quaid and possibly Bruce Campbell. A connection I found between these actors is interesting. Both Quaid and Campbell played American President Ronald Reagan. Dennis Quaid's Reagan movie, a biographical historical drama, will be out later this year on August 30th, 2024. Also in this will be Penelope Ann Miller, Robert Davi, Leslie Andown, John Voight, C. Thomas Howell, Kevin Dillon, and Kevin Sorbo. Bruce Campbell played Ronald Reagan in the Fargo television series. This ran on FX from 2014 through the present. He was in Season 2, Episode 5, entitled The Gift of the Magi in 2015. Also in this was Kirsten Dunst and Ted Danson. Campbell was also in the Fargo movie in 1996. This was directed by Joel Cohen and written by Joel and Ethan Cohen. All right, connections. Movie 43, a 2013 anthology comedy. Dennis Quaid and Sean William Scott were both in this. Sean William Scott was in the segment Happy Birthday along with Gerard Butler and Johnny Knoxville. Dennis Quaid was in the segment The Pitch along with Greg Kinnear, rapper Common. Seth MacFarlane was also in this. My YouTube channel is Easter Egg Psychic. There I go back and look at movies and television from the past. I analyze these for possible references to future media. These may appear in the form of anecdotes, idioms, anagrams, hidden in the subtext of the work in question. I also use an unconventional method where I look at the likenesses of the actors. And what I found is you can take the likenesses, match these up to some of the anecdotal items, and show past, present, and future information about actors and other personalities or may resemble the personalities in the movie or television episode that you're watching. My email contact is easteregguy, that's G-U-Y, at yahoo.com. Thanks for watching.